Hello, la, YouTube, and ho, 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 it is Christmas time, and I am Domino. Welcome to episode 74 of our Pokemon Ultra Moon Expanded Let's Play. In the last episode, it accidentally turned into a filler side quest episode. Um, getting myself up to date with everything that's in the game so I can stop avoiding spoilers. If you do want to check that out, make sure you go ahead and click the icon up at the top of the screen. In today's episode, we're continuing on with the story, um, the after story. Post, the post-game story. Um, so if you're excited for this episode of Pokemon Ultra Moon, make sure you hit the like button down below. If you want to become a member of the growing domination, make sure you hit the subscribe button as well. Ah, team recap. Sure, fine. As quick as I can. Group Punch, Frisco, Buttons, Arukenimon, Oblivion, Brock. That's it. I'm ready to play. As I said in the last episode, I haven't played this game in, in like... I haven't played this game in like a week since I recorded the last episodes, which I did, uh, I did all of those, like, break the fourth wall. When did I record them? I don't remember. Um, I don't remember. Anyway, we are here now. Domino, over here. If you head into Pony Grove here, there's an Ultra Beast right here in Alola! My young friend Domino, congrats on becoming champion. I have heard that your final battle against Master Hao was quite fiery. And now the two of you will look into the mysteries of the Ultra Beast, is that right? I will support you however I can. I brought you both a little something. Beast balls, beast balls, beast balls, beast balls, beast balls! I need more beast balls. Crap. My Prima Marina loves Molosados too! Thanks, Miss Wick! Young Master Gladion also left something with you. It is Type Null. Where did Gladion go? I was not ready for that. Okay. I'm just thinking about soft resetting for shinies. I don't think you can breed those, right? I'll also entrust you with all the memory drives needed to change the type of Type Null's evolution, the Pokemon Sil Valley. See the whole stack of memory drives. Type Null. It was being researched as a possible weapon to be used to fight the Ultra Beast, but I think a trainer like you, Domino. Master Gladion thinks you'll be able to show Type Null that there is much more to this wide world than that. Man, they're Gladion! He just doesn't want to let me win, does he? When he gets back from that training of his, I'm definitely asking him for a battle! But now, I'm off to Pony Grove! The members of the Ultra Recon Squad were also making for Pony Grove, I believe. Should I assume that they're going to give me Ultra or Beast Balls? Hope so. Hope so. Ooh! Thank you very much for coming, the Ultra Beasts, now called St Stackataka. <laughs> Stackataka are lost and wandering in Pony Grove. It is my guess they are distraught. They most likely will attack anything they see. Here are some Beast Balls. Normally you would have to buy these at Aether Paradise, but they were kind enough to give some to us. They were kind enough to give some to us. Or you too, Hal, please take these. Hey, thanks! So if we're giving these balls, does that mean you want us to catch them? We leave that to you. All we wish for is that the stack attacker be able to live peacefully. We have learned from what we have- what? We have learned from what happened with Necrozma. We must not try to control these creatures, but focus on protecting them. It would put both ourselves and the stack attacker at ease if you would capture them. Yo, sounds good to me! Come on, Domino! Let's go up the stack attacker! Zaka Zaka, come out, come out, wherever you are! Alright, uh, um, so, I don't know what type stack attack it is. Should I go with the try to paralyze it option? 
I guess I'll go with the try to paralyze it option. Oh! Here we go! Stakataka! My question is, can you run into, can you find Ultra Beasts? Can, no, 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 excuse me, excuse me. Can you find this Ultra Beast specifically in an Ultra Wormhole? Okay, I outspeed it. Iron Head, that's not gonna do a whole lot, okay. So it's part steel. Brock, do you want to dodge one real quick? I would love for Brock to dodge one. I would also love to figure out what type it is. And also, like, how many... Because I know... There's a lot of times where, like... Or, excuse me, excuse me, excuse me. Like, Kartana, there were four of them, right? I don't want to catch all four on screen. Let's catch one on screen, and then we'll catch the rest off screen. I think I can use one more. I think I can use one more. Also, if I have to go through this many potions in every single Ultra Beast battle, I'm never going to wind up looking like Komo'o. And I only have 26 more episodes to do so. I think it will live one more. It should. Yeah, it'll definitely live one more unless I get a crit. Yeah, perfect. Alright, Brock. In an effort to not... In an effort... Oh, crap! I threw the wrong ball. Hop out, please. Hop out, please. Hop out, please. Thank you. How did I know? How did I just know? How did I just know that Brock was gonna live? For that, Brock... Go ahead and take this max potion. Yet again. Wow. How did I know? It's like... I should not be able to... Uh, I love it. I love it. I love it. Alright, here we go. Let me do the right way this time. Beast Ball. How come I only have six Beast Balls? What the heck is this? Count the shakes. One shake. Two shake. Three shake. Did not expect that. I did not expect that. I haven't heard of there being multiple stack attackers. Also, I had also never actually read the name. This is one of those that I saw the name and blurred my eyes. I'm like, nope. I'm not oh, critical capture. It's over. You're done, skis. Woo! Critical capture is so hype. It happens so rarely. I think that's our first critical capture in our playthrough. Good job, Brock. Thank you, Brock. Amazing. Amazing, Brock. Look at this thing. I really like Stack Attacka. It's probably like Stack Attacka. No, it's Stack. Stack Attack. Stack Attacka. I'm going with Stack Attacka. You won't convince me of it. When Stonewall started moving and attacking, the Brute's ident true identity was this mysterious life form which brings to mind an Ultra Beast. Uh, no, I will not give Stack Attacka a nickname. I'll send him to the How many are there? Okay. No, no, over here! Oh, don't come up to me like that. That stack of tackle was too strong. I was nowhere even close to catching it. No matter, it will likely keep a low profile now and won't attack another Pokemon for some time. We can use this time to analyze the data we gathered and with the help of Aether Foundation, hopefully capture it. Yes, it seems there's still some stack attacker wandering about. Gotcha! I'll be sure to capture one this time and hand it over to the Ultra Recon Squad. Stack attack where are you? You want me to catch him more? Oh, 
Okay, um, I think... Can I fly back here? I mean, it's not super annoying to get back here. I want to try and use less potions. I guess I'm gonna... I might cut it out post... post recording. Because I think I'm almost out of Ultra Ball. Or Ultra... or Beast Balls, right? I only have... What can I... what's a, what's a better strategy? So the strategy I think should be... I want to hit it harder. Rock, steel. Okay. Okay. Uh, rock though. What kind of rock move is it going to have? Try leading with uh, a Raquinid and hit him with the skull. See if that'll do a bit more damage. I wish I could fly back. I mean, I guess I could lead Buttons, but he's a Steel type, so that won't work. The steel resists grass. Steel does not resist water. Excuse me. It took all the time to figure out how to put a mute button in, and I don't even use it. Wait, Wick. Wick, what are you going to do? What are you doing, Jeremy? Okay. I thought Wick was going to... All right, let me see if I run into another one. Did. Wow. I wonder how many there are. Before, like... Because I want to move on. I want to do the next thing. Like, what's next? What did we say this was? Episode 74? Yeah. So... I don't want it to go too long. I'm like, just under half. Or over half. Crunch. 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 Most certainly. Um, let's go with Crunch. Oh, I'm probably dead. Hex Goddess! Hex Goddess! Hex Goddess. <laughs> oh my gosh! Our Kenimon! Okay, that would have been too wild. That would have been too much. That would have been too much. Oh, you got a beast boost. Your defense rose. Really? 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 First things first, I'm the realist. I'm gonna use Thunder Punch. He's used Iron Defense, and he just got beast boost. Perfect. I say one more, and then I'm throwing a beast ball. Rock, hold back. Probably do one more, but that's okay. Ah, I didn't do the, the right. But okay, let's catch a first ball. First ball. First ball. Count the rolls. Uno, dos, tres. Hold on, Brock. Okay, who's going to take an iron head? I have Oblivion right here. I have Oblivion right here. Alright, I need you to stay in one of these two beast balls. You can take your pick, whichever you like better. Whichever you like better, Stakataka. Yes! Cool! Quick capture. Quick capture. Just a couple minutes off the clock. Oblivion didn't do crap. Excuse me. Goodness gracious. <clears throat> didn't do anything. Domino! We received the stack attacker. How was able to capture? Together with the Aether Foundation, we should be able to gather useful data in order to protect the Ultra Beast. I expected no less from the two of you who competed for the championship. You've helped us resolve an extremely delicate situation. We thank you. We take our leave now until we meet again. I love Ultra Recon. They're so cool.
Those are some micro epic battles. Primarina had a good time too. Come on, Domino, let's head home. What? That's not what. I was not expecting this. What the heck? Why am I in here? All right. I put it off long enough. Now that Domino has become the champion. Yeah, this is it. We're really definitely going to put away these boxes today. I've been saying that for a year, Mom. Oh, now who could that be? Oh, get out of here! No! Go away! <gasps> Domino, I, I, you've got to... What's wrong? What do you mean what's wrong? Everything is wrong. I don't know what to do. Oh, are you one of Domino's friends? I'm his mom. It's so nice to meet you. Eek! Oh, oh, so ugly! I mean, so free! I mean, I'm sorry! Oh, wrong voice. Whoa. I mean, I'm sorry. I mean, I'm sorry. No, I mean, I'm Sophocles. I'm, I am a very sorry Sophocles. Sorry, let me calm down a bit. I, I came here because I need your help, Domino. A bunch of stained trash guys appeared out of nowhere and they took over Festival Plaza. Oh. That's pretty cool. The space here suddenly became all twisted and then the programming of the plaza was rewritten. That's why the castle looks so freaking cool, dude. Oh, you get it, Domino. Yeah, the way it's so dark and menacing, whoever did this certainly has cool taste in architecture. Still, they broke through my impenetrable security system, even if they did take advantage of a system malfunction. And they've taken complete control of Festival Plaza. Be careful, these guys know what they're doing. Please, Domino, you've got to help me get take Festival Plaza back. Absolutely, let's do it. I'm glad you're with me, Domino. You are the champion after all. Well, let's go then. In hindsight, I should have gone and bought revives. <laughs> Who are you? Nobody should be able to enter Team Rocket's castle. I I have admin rights. What? How dare you try to confuse me with your nerdy language? Ahem, no matter. Team Rocket's castle is under our control. There's nothing you can do, whoever you are. <laughs> it seems like this group calls itself Team Rocket. It definitely don't seem like nice people. I can't believe I've allowed Festival Paws to be taken over by people like that. Still, he said this castle was under their control. What exactly did he mean? Give me a second, I'll check. This is actually pretty I've got it, Domino. They have some sort of program lock that prevents us from using the Pokemon in their party. We need to figure out some way to get our Team Rocket out- to get Team Rocket out of here, but without using our own Pokemon. I don't know what to do! I'm lost! Oh my gosh, what do I do? Can- do, can I leave? He's blocking the- oh my god. These guys. So many trainers come and go through Plessible Faza, taking over his place will let us steal Pokemon from all over Alola. This- If this would have been in the original game- I wouldn't have such a bad taste about Festival Plaza. This makes sense. This is something Team Rocket would do. This has always been their goal, to capture Pokemon from everywhere. So what do they do? They take over the, that's awesome. Ah, Team Rocket's castle, just look at that design. Fit to send the whole world into a vortex of fear and panic. We're in cyberspace, right? I didn't know it was this realistic. Boss took advantage of the distortion caused by the Ultra Wormhole and took over Festival Plaza. That's so next level. Oh my god. Team Rocket's castle is under our control. Blah, 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 blah. And what do you say? It turns out we can't use our own Pokemon either. Thank goodness for the battle agency. We can still use other people's Pokemon after all. Do you have any ideas on how to get Team Rocket out of here, Dabado? Dabado? Yes, I do. You have any ideas? Other people's Pokemon! Other, pe other people's Pokemon? Oh, right, of course. 
If we use the battle agency rules, we can use other people's Pokemon to battle. It doesn't matter if we can't use our own. Just a sec. This is my admin rights to add. Oh, this voice is making me yawn. This is my admin rights to access the debug features, reporting the reception program. Oh, this is a program? What? I made it so we could use the battle agency now, too. I wish there was more I could do, but I can't even access my full admin rights. I need you to VT Rocket using the, the battle agency, Domino. I'll try and get complete access while you keep that busy. Question is how much? Oh, I can't save. Got it. Welcome to the Battle Agency. Battle Agency is a facility where you use a borrowed Pokemon in battle along with visitors in Festival Plaza. You're an agent here and have a grade that shows that you're great as an agent. You can borrow a particularly strong Pokemon as an agent, and the higher your grade gets, the stronger your Pokemon you can borrow. Raise your grade and aim to be a top agent. Now, please select a challenge to start. Please select challenge to start your challenge, Mr. Domino. Okay, let's do it. All right, let's move on to battle preparation. Would you like to prepare for your battles? What would you like to do? Uh, choose Pokemon? We can now lend you these Pokemon. Which would you like? Deluxe Minior Meganium. I mean, I'm taking Meganium all day. Next is ask other trainers to join your team to battle with you, but you don't seem to know trainers who can ask you to join your team. To ask trainers to be your teammates, please use Street Pass. You don't have enough teammates, so we'll introduce a trainer or two. Please select the challenge. Request the project that you protect the proper look as the agent. Battle agents. I don't know if I like. Okay, never mind. Let me introduce the trainers who will battle along with you. Wow, that was nice and bland. Woo! Look at this guy. Oh, who are you? I'll beat you. Yeah! Gen 1! Turn this up. Hold on. There we go. Turn it up in my ear. It'll be plenty loud for you. He's got a regular Raticate! Let's go! Let's go, Meganium! Oh! <laughs> I have a two cannon and an unpheasant. Why do I have two fire types? Or two flying types. I said the wrong thing. Are we actually doing this? Also, why did uh what would be the right order here? Toxic. Toxic first is definitely the right thing. I'm an idiot. This is how I've been playing some of my battles on uh, some of my random battles. I'm curious as to why I can't use my own Pokemon. Is that going to be like that through all of this like little arc that we have? Don't flinch me, thank you. Alright, now watch as he does no damage. Of course he has a citrus berry. Or in berry. Why did I pick this Pokemon? I'm about to switch. You know what? There's absolutely no reason for me to do this. Alright, let's switch. The Ganium can't be switched out. Why can't Meganium be switched out? What did I do? What did I do? Can I switch now? Is that because I used Ingrain? 
Yep. Toxic. That's actually kind of annoying. If you switched it to two times speed right now, I wouldn't be upset. Please, why can't I? I think it's because I used the ingrain. Wish I could switch it to two times right now. TBH. I have leftovers? How could, why does toxic go, like, why does poison damage go last? This is going to take forever. If I, if I have a chance to pause after this battle, this will just be a little... A little lead in to. Oh my goodness! It's just this will just be a lead in to um, our Team Rainbow Rocket arc. See how many episodes it takes, because I know there's like there's some cool battles in here. He's not doing any damage. And the only damage that I can do off of him, since I can't poison him, is the leech seed. That's... Alright, so leftovers heals me, right? Ingrain heals me. Leech seed heals me. Poison... Let's see, let's see what I where I can get up to this time. Alright, uh, I'm just gonna let him hit me. If he would have used freaking wing attack, I could have been out of this battle. But I'm pretty sure I'm gonna heal too much for poison to kill me. Yep. Great. Thanks. Battle started seven minutes ago. He still has one Pokemon left. Okay. Who is this guy? Who is this guy? It's not me. Get out of here. All right, note to self, next time, don't use ingrain. Let's go, Toucan. Smack him, I mean, this Toucan is nice and all, but if we remember episode 17, we definitely caught ourselves a much better looking bird. Impossible! This kid defeated me? That's unfair. You shouldn't be able to battle so effectively with other people's Pokemon. Ah, get him, guys! We can't let you take back Team Rocket's castle. The boss's plans depend on it. Just in time. Full system restore. Target set to Team Rocket. Executed kick from Festival Plaza. <laughs> he ran at me! Whew. That was close, Domino. Thanks for your help. You kept them busy just long enough for me to get back full admin access. I've used that access to lock out Team Rocket from Festival Plaza forever. I also restored all the features and everything to normal, too. 
about the castle? I I kind of like what they did with the castle, even though they were our enemies. I'll add it to one of the themes, and I'll set up some boss data that would be perfect for this kind of castle. If you want to change the look of the castle, try raising your festival plaza rank. Also, this is for you. You helped me out a lot. But wait. I'm really glad you came with me, Domino. Let's go home. Really? Really? Are those boxes still there? Oh, watch this, Domino. Meowth picked up a new move recently. Meowth turned on the TV. So graceful. I bet it saw me turn on the TV and wanted to try for itself. It's just in. The Aether Foundation is holding a press conference as we speak, addressing the black clouds that appeared over Pony Island. We go now live to our coverage at the scene. <clears throat> I know that many of you must have heard of the dark clouds covering Pony Island on the news. You may be feeling concerned about what is going on, but let me put your fears to rest. This phenomenon was caused by a previously unknown Pokemon called Necrozma. Necrozma passed through an ultra wormhole, a wormhole that connects different worlds, and came here to steal Alola's light. Necrozma? What does she mean? Steal our light? There's nothing to be worried about, though. Thanks to actions of one brave trainer, the threat has already been dealt with. Alola will not be swallowed by darkness. Where's Faba going? The Aether Foundation will conduct expensive re extensive research into the Ultra Wormholes so we can prevent any such events in the future. Be specific, we'll begin by... Oh! I thought that was just like a little square image just popped up right... Uh, right up there? But it's in the background of the Aether Foundation. An, an ultra wormhole? But why? How? Eek! Who exactly are you, sir? Ooh, wait, I have to come up with this voice now? Alright. The technology of Aether Foundation! The, no, 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 no. Oh, the technology of Aether Foundation! The knowledge of other worlds! It will be very useful to Team Rocket. Or rather, Team Rainbow Rocket. He mean to suggest that this his people created this ultra wormhole intentionally? We will not allow this to go unchecked. The president, come back. Hello, are you seeing this? The sudden turn of events has left the scene in chaos. Team Rainbow Rocket, is this some kind of prank? That is how you lead in! Oh, what happened to the TV, Domino? Bet it's Kukui. Now, I wonder who that is. Domino! Wow, Alola, Lily. Uh, Alola, ma'am, I'm so sorry to come barging in all of a sudden. I was just watching the news at the professor's lab and... And did you see it too, Domino? Ultra Wormhole! Yes, an ultra wormhole opened up in the middle of the press conference, and they and then everything got so confused. Maybe it was some kind of performance. I'm sure Mother must be fine, but still, I I'm gonna see what's happening at Aether Paradise. I guess I just want to let you know. Sorry again for disturbing you. Oh, did Lily leave already? I thought she came over for a visit. She looked worried though. I hope everything is okay. I'm glad that at least I never have to worry about you, Domino. And on that note, we are going to save the game in the next episode. Episode Rainbow Rocket begins! Woo! That was a great lead into it. I like the play on the Festival Plaza, like I explained earlier. It's something Team Rocket would totally do. And now they open an Ultra Wormhole. 
why i can't wait to play some more if you enjoyed today's episode make sure to the like button down below and if you want to become a member of the domination make sure you subscribe as well we'll see you in the next episode where episode rainbow rocket begins until then have a blessed day